Hi, hello, it's me again, Marina. I'm 59 and I live in Sweden. So it's time for another video with my birthstone collection uh, palettes. This is round two for you that haven't seen them and for you who are maybe new here. I'm doing a series when I'm using uh, the palette of the month and December is turquoise. And it looks like this. And this time around I'm comparing it randomly with some other palette from the same series. So I randomly picked this one and it's Ruby for July. Uh, not the easiest color story to combine. Uh, but I'm going to do my best. I've been sitting here staring at the palettes trying to figure out a color combination, but <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. Uh, yeah, so I think I will start actually with a ruby one for uh, July. And I will use the, uh, the darkest one. I think this is the darker, darkest one of all the two palettes and it's that one it's called proud dark matte brown and I will place it in my outer corner so I haven't been filming in quite a while uh, it's been a bit of a rough month with everything RA and work and I have some other health is issues that I'm trying to fix uh, so I've been to the doctors a couple of times and yeah it's been you know the Christmas rush trying to fix everything today is actually Christmas Day so I know uh, as I'm filming this a lot of you is celebrating in Sweden we celebrate on the 24th so I had my big day yesterday so Christmas day for us is more of a lazy day, hanging in the couch, watching TV, doing nothing. And I'm tired. I stayed up until 1.30 this morning. <laughs> so I'm tired and yeah, we've just been doing nothing today. So here I am filming. Um, I hope you're having a great Christmas. Uh, so I will continue with the turquoise palette. All of these palettes have the larger pan are always the same name as the palette. So this is turquoise and all of the palettes have one pressed glitter in it, which I don't mind. I know some people do. Um, yeah, so I will take the turquoise matte called Good Vibes. Yeah, and so I'm working tomorrow. Most people are off since it's a bank holiday. Uh, but not when you work in retail like I do. You don't get to be off. I'm lucky I'm not working. Well, today actually the store is closed. It's one of three closed days during the whole year. So no one is working today, but yesterday, our Christmas, people were working, and tomorrow as well, even though it's bank holiday. If you hear noise, it's my hubby in his garage workshop, and he got a new speaker for as a Christmas gift so <clears throat> he's playing loud music in there <laughs> he's he likes rock music and I don't you know like this more heavy sorry my phone is ringing yeah okay so I'm sorry my phone rang it's my kids they are on their way here uh, I will take a smaller brush and try to 
blend this out a little bit. I don't remember what I was talking about. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, anyhow, I hope you're all having a great Christmas. I know your day is today. Ours is over by now. Yeah, I was talking about the music, wasn't I? Can you hear it? <laughs> he is playing in there. He's actually making a thing for me to hang all my earrings on. I have like a million and they're just laying around everywhere. So he's making a, a thing where I can hang them on so that I can see what I have and have some order to everything. <laughs> He's sneezing very loudly. <laughs> Can you hear me? Yeah. So I'm looking forward for him to finish it. So that I can clean up my earring place. <laughs> I think I will do an, you know, like this before and after pictures of my earrings when I'm done. Okay, so now I have used one shadow from each palette. What next? Hmm. As you know, I'm in the middle of my Christmassy looks. There's only one left and that's tomorrow because then for me Christmas is over after tomorrow. After that I will do more like wintry New Year's looks, I think. Uh, so, but this will not be Christmassy, of course, because well, maybe there's a lot of reds in one of them, but the combination won't be Christmassy, at least not in the way I think Christmassy looks should be. Uh, uh, I will cut my grains as per usual and Yeah, like so. Um, so what to use on my mid lid then? Hmm. I think I will take this one called Witty in my inner part of that free space and there's a lot of noise here today I will go and close the door that is banging upstairs hang on yeah that was an interruption for several minutes <laughs> sorry uh, yeah, yeah, I will use the witty eye shadow. Spraying it a little bit. This will be a strange look, I think. Yeah, so more tomorrow it's back to work again. Uh, work until 8. My hobby is off for two weeks because his workplace closes during Christmas. Uh, 
it's so unfair. <laughs> I want to be off for two weeks as well. Um, and then I will be using the Influential, that one, from the turquoise palette. Yeah, but I work for two days, then I'm off on Thursday, and then work Friday and Saturday, and then I'm off for a couple of days again. I don't have to work on New Year's Eve. So that's great. What do you think? This looks strange. Oh, I have some candy here. This is typical Swedish Christmas candy. Um, I don't... These are, you know, the chewy... What do you call it? We call this... It's a Santa and it's called Skumtomte. Skum means foam. Uh, but it's not foam, of course, but it's got, you know, this chewy stuff. And now I can't speak. <laughs> For a while. You just have to watch me. <laughs> because it's so chewy. <laughs> Stupid me. <laughs> they are only sold during Christmas. And I can't even describe the taste, but they're really good. Okay. Need to add some more of the witty color. Going back to the first brown that I used. Um. Okay, so under my eyes. What will I use? <clears throat> I always try to focus the most, well of course on the palette of the month, in this case this one turquoise, so that I won't use more shadows from this one than this one. <laughs> um, hmm. But I, I'm done with the shadows and I used two from each palette so that's good but I will uh, I have to add some more uh, base this is from Gloss Gods Like so. I think this brush brush has kind of lost its its shape. Um, yeah, under my eye, I will take the pressed glitter, the turquoise one. It's called Wild Thing. Now, I know a lot of you don't like pressed glitters, and some people are scared to put glitter around their eyes, but I am not. I have never had any problems. Except for maybe some glitter fallout. <laughs> A 
and I was stupid because I should have used oh. I will try to fix it I will use the the, the turquoise one uh, turquoise one as a base now I've already got glitter there but I will try to just And then the glitter on top. I usually don't have problem with these glitters in these palettes sticking, but this this wasn't that easy. It kind of don't want to stick. Okay, I don't know if this was the best, but anyhow. Okie dokie. Um, shit. I ruined my place here. Messing around. All my brushes flew everywhere. Because I'm clumsy. <laughs> Okay, something like that. So as per usual, I will go off camera and do the rest of my face, you know, liner and mascara and all of that stuff. Maybe I add something. I need inner corner highlight and stuff like that. So see you in a bit. So I'm done. Uh, I've been using the turquoise for December and the Ruby for July palettes by BH Cosmetics Birthstone Collection. And from the, uh, the pressed glitter is everywhere. Uh, from the turquoise palette, I've used the, hang on, I need to check. No, the Good Vibes, the influential and the glitter called wild thing the glitter is under my eye and i've used as a base for the glitter i've used that one turquoise underneath uh, and from the ruby palette i've used proud witty and That's it, I think. Yeah, that was only those two. Uh, so that's that for the shadows. Uh, my inner corner highlight is from 5050 Makeup. This brand does unfortunately not exist anymore. And this is uh, Opal Goldie one. And I also use that one on my cheeks. Uh, yeah, the base for my eyeshadows is uh, that base from Gloss Gods, and I've used a black eyeliner. It's the Cake Eyeliner in Black from Makeup Store, and the line that I drew here and under the wing is made by Honor Cake It Eyeliner Cake It Liner Honor from Artitude Cosmetics. And my mascara is, as per usual these days, high key volume mascara from Beauty Bay. And my brows are the Deep Brow Pomade from 
Anastasia Beverly Hills and I use mine in Ash Brown. This is the only brow product I own and the only one I ever use. Uh, so for my face I used, I didn't use a primer because this is going off. I think me and my hubby will go into the sauna so I will wash it off just soon. But I used my little sample from Filorga Flash Nude Foundation that I'm mixing with um, some other from NYX because this one is a bit too dark. Where do I have it? Oh, I can't find it, but yeah, I'm mixing two together. Uh, powder is as per usual my The Original No Color Powder from RCMA. And my bronzer is from Kaleidos, the Charisma Contour Palette Warm and Medium. I can show you. Uh, it's this one I used as a bronzer. And my highlight, as, as I said, from 5050 Opal. And my blush was a gift to me from Steph, not your basic Steph, my beautiful friend. Planet Revolution, and this is a cheek and lip duo fresh raspberry i don't use it on my lips because it tastes and smells heavily of rose so i can feel the rose smell in my whole my nose all the time that's okay but in my mouth not so okay it's a really gorgeous color though and my lippy is from juvia's place and it's the perfect red and it looks like this uh, I'm joining the December is for red lips hashtag on Instagram with um, the nice things fairy and aging beauty queens with D. Um, you're posting a red lippy every day in December. That's basically what it's all about. <laughs> so that's what I'm doing. Um, go and check them out on Instagram. I can write their addresses down below. So, this is it. The gemstones is from a gift from Steph also. Don't know where she bought them, but I got some from her. Yeah, that's it. Um, I will go and have Christmas dinner number two. You know, there's always so much left over and food from from Christmas Eve. We celebrated yesterday, as I said. So we will eat that food for like three days straight, at least. <laughs> and then I won't have it again for another year. Okay, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Um, and if you're new here, welcome. I hope you consider subscribing. Uh, I'm really happy to have you here and I'm happy to ha have all of you here. Uh, so I hope you're having a wonderful Christmas, a happy new year. I don't know if I will post any more videos before New Year's. We'll see, but I don't think so. Uh, take care and be careful out there. Bye bye.